looks like I better reevaluate things because poor Steel Falls is bone dry. Never seen it like that. Definitely gonna have to get out there and take a peek. It's crazy. Pyramid Peak or Creek Bone Dry. Kind of crazy. Water up here. Barely flowing. None. The valley came up already. Top, it's probably about all the sunlight I'll have because it is almost going down. And they're a big group of kids or teenagers, probably, I don't know, it might be in their 20s following me, but they didn't keep up, so hopefully they know where they're going. Gotta get to the top. Now to come up, where still falls. Um, there you go. Kind of slab. Has to show way back down there. These people right here, they're looking for the trail. So, they hopefully figure out it's over here. And then get up this way. And you gotta come zigzag along these rocks up here and across that granite right to here. And it is dry as a bone. Look at this. That's Horsetail Falls, my friends. Or lack thereof. I gotta get up to Avalanche Lake right up here. See how full it is. Let's see. There's still some water in Avalanche Lake. And this is the headwaters of Horsetail Falls, or Horsetail Nothingness. So I think I'm gonna go chill right over here. Or right over here. I didn't realize how much good camping is over here. I'm gonna check it out. Not often I can hop across these rocks like this. Things are really cool over here. I can honestly say I have never explored this area before. Every time I've come over Horsetail Falls, I have jammed straight back there to Ropey Lake. So this will be cool getting a different view. Look at how it just opens up out here. So cool. Wow, look at this. You can hike all the way up that ridge if you wanted. Or I mean, I guess I could if I wanted, but I'm not going to. I am gonna do. Let's probably go out there and get a great view of falls and just the sunset and the valley overall. This is freaking awesome. Yes, all the way over to this side of the lake. I'm gonna have to check that out too. This part of the lake is iced over. It's the corner of the lake. This is so cool. I actually have not been able to get over on this side due to the water being so high. So times like these when it's low, 
I'm able to actually get out here and explore this side, which I am starting to really like because it seems like there's a lot of hidden camping back here. This is just a peninsula. And it gives you a good view of the whole lake. Yeah, look at that. Pyramid Peak right there. It's looming. Got the lake all to myself. Explore the lake. Now oh, it's time to explore out here. Dude, this is so rad how flat and crazy it is higher. Although I did hear some tree branches snapping back here in the woods, which is kind of uneasy and you know, unsettling, but uh, it's not a bear, so. Oh yeah, somebody's rock stacking. I mean, I mean, it's not the greatest wind exposure, but you could literally get a tent down in some of these flat spots. Look at this, and it just keeps going. I'm gonna come down over here. Our falls. Kind of see what's going on. Look at that. There's the highway down there. see it. I'm gonna find a spot to come have a little snack and then being that that is gonna go behind his mountains fairly soon I'm gonna start making my way back down at the falls and I have to go Oh my god, I can cross right here. This is so freaking sad. I can cross all the way up here. Okay, well I guess I don't have to go back up there. Oh my god, sad, sad, sad. Thought I was going to have to go back up and around. This is normally raging, this whole entire thing right here. And there's ice in that. You're not only really supposed to be able to walk down the falls, but quite honestly, like, I could have came right across there. Right around that bend. But, like, I uh, come around that bend right there. But yeah, you're not exactly supposed to be able to do this. These falls should be raging this time of year. This is sad. Like, you could literally walk across these right now. Like, right here, I don't even have to go up, back up to cross. I could just walk right across these. Right here. Boop, boop, boop. Like, what in the world? Yeah. And that's the 
the edge of the falls down there. That's where they really start raising. Now I'm gonna go over there. I gotta go back up and around this, so I think what I'm gonna do is either go back up here on the granite, let's get a good view of the valley, have my snack. Yeah, that's one thing I'll do. I haven't been up here, so why not? It'll be fun. Okay, here it is. Uh, let's go back up this way, it's easier. Yes, this is where I can hang out. It's shady hillside over here. Past that. That's unfortunately where I'm hiking out, so it's gonna be cold all the way down that canyon. Better fuel up now and get started here in the next half hour. Look how beautiful this canyon is. That's why I come out here. It honestly doesn't look too busy. Probably because it's Veterans Day. But you, I thought more people would be hiking. I got lucky. I am literally the only one. Well, probably not the only one, but at the top of these falls. Probably the only one here at Avalanche Lake. Probably a lot more people in Desolation Wilderness. Well, back further. I am in Desolation Wilderness, but people that are back further, that are camping during the week. This is a Monday hike. I rarely get to do these. But when you have a day off, you go hiking. down there and I'm really not in a hurry because it's really nice up here. I hiked over to the Ralston Ridge side of Horsetail Falls. This is Ralston Ridge. Up here. It's my chill spot. It's letting my shirt air out. It's going to be chilly on the way down against that wall. Over there. Oh, over there. Yeah, this is Ralston Ridge. This is a, actually a lot of cool areas, but over here on this side. Like, you can really hike that wall. It would be hell. But yeah, you could definitely route find your way up to the top of that. It'd be scary in some spots, but it could be done. Oh, you just go right up and over that ridge. Hike along that ridge and go over to Lake of the Woods. It's also fun. And the 
this is my little tree friend I'm hanging out with. And that right there, peeking out, is everybody's favorite homeboy. Pyramid Peak. Okay. And it almost makes me want to stay here until it gets dark. This freaking alpine glow against these rocks right here. Oh man, it's gonna be crazy. Right behind me too. This is insanely magnificent. Alright, wow, when that starts going down, get your butt back to town. I gotta get going, the sun's gonna go down quick. This is why you hike at sunset, folks. I don't care if I might be hiking out of here in the dark. Look at this. Look at this alpine glow. Oh, it's not even getting groovy yet. Look at that. Look at the valley down there. I just gotta go down these rocks. Oh yeah. Um, learning how to hike horse tail falls. Okay. So I'm at the base basically almost at the ridge. It's pretty easy to rock hop up your way, but the key if you want to get get easy er stay on the far side of that on the way up and on the way down. It's a whole hell of a lot easier. I mean you just veer to the right, go down the granite slab safely. If you have to crab walk, do it. And then you get down there to the flat and you're out of here. The dead tree branch. So the proper way to come through here is right through here. You get right. It doesn't look like a trail when you start going. It is. Pops out on the other side. Up there. Up there. I mean, you just cut up over, kind of whichever way you want through there. I mean, there's five different ways where you can hook up left and go that way. 
Yeah, I mean, once you get past this part. go that way. It's not the way to go. <laughs> this way. Or, let's take that way. Right here. Right here. Right here. Okay, falling is not cool, so, yeah, but you basically go right through here and around there. A little bit of climbing involved, but wow, look at that. get lost. I hear when you come out the granite. You don't keep going up. You go over here. This little spigot right there. Takes you down and around. It's just kind of a little boomerang here so it's easy to get lost.
It's not like we start seeing people again. Not this time. I just can't get enough of this ridge line. How awesome it is at sunset. Oh my god. So awesome. But the sun is gonna set soon. So just probably get going. Taking the super primitive trail back to the car. Get a chance to see all of her sleep. Man, that's amazing.